Hello everybody and welcome to this new episode of this Lumion course in where we will see the file panel and we will see a bit deeper how to import a model to Lumion. So once we are here in the file panel we can create a new project by clicking here. We can load an example project if we go here we will see that Lumion offers us different projects which have been modeled in different softwares and once they have been imported in Lumion, they have been worked a lot in Lumion and then we will be able to check the power of this program. We can go as well to Benchmark where we will check the specification of our computer like we saw before. And we have these options. We have the option of loading a project. If I click here, Lumion will show us the most recent projects so we can open them easily. At the same time we have this another option in where we will be able to merge project. We need of course to have a project already saved in our computer. Here we have the option of saving our project, the current changes, and here we will be able to save that project with another name. So like everything in Lumion, this file panel is very intuitive and very easy to learn. Look that if I click here in build, I will go to the build viewport and I will always be able to go again to the file panel and create a new file, load, save, whatever. So I will click again in build and I will go now to import a model. Look that here in this left side of the screen we have these four categories, content library, materials, landscape, and weather. We saw it before. Here in content library, if I click on it, it will appear all of these options below. If I click here in materials, the menu will change and in landscape and weather as well. So we will go to content library and look carefully because here, we can see that we have clicked already these imported models. It's in another kind of blue. It means that it is pressed. At the same time, we will have to be careful if there are any options here, any buttons already pressed, because that can change what is happening on the screen. Anyway, if we want to import something, we have two options. We have the green button, import new model, it means that we will import something from the outside of Lumion. I mean, a model made in SketchUp, for example, or in 3D Max, or any another modeling software. Instead of this option, I have this one, imported model. If I click twice, it will appear this imported models library we have already seen. Here, as you can see now, there is just one model, this Greek column. It is already here because we imported this geometry before. In case we want to use this Greek column in another project, now it's much more easier because it is here already in this library. So I have just to click on it and move the mouse into the viewport and click in the place I want to drop the model. Once I have done that, I will press escape because I don't want to place more models in my canvas. So once we have placed one model from our imported models library from Lumion, we will do the same with another model, but this time from the outside, from the exterior of Lumion. So I will click here in imported new model, the green button. And this time I want you to import this file made in a SketchUp called Barcelona Pavilion. You will find it attached with the course. So I will click on it and I will say open. Then it appears this imported model window in where we will put a name, Barcelona Pavilion. We will decide in which folder we want to place this model. We can put it here in the main folder or we can create a new one. And we will say if we want to import the edges and lines. I recommend you to don't import edges and lines. So I will click here in OK. And once the computer has loaded the model, 
I will have the chance to place my geometry where I want. So I will click on here, for example, one click and then escape because I don't want to repeat this action. I will zoom out and now you can see all the Barcelona Pavilion placed here in my viewport. Take notice that here in the imported models library, I have another model now. It is called Barcelona Pavilion, like we named it, and it is placed in the first position here in the library because it is the last one I have imported into Lumion. If I want to make this window disappear, then I will have to click here, for example, in All. So once we have our Barcelona Pavilion already placed, we will save this file. So we will go to the file panel, we will click on it, and we will go to save as. Here I will decide my root and I will put a name for this Lumion file. This is a Lumion file. So I will call the Lumion file Barcelona Pavilion. I can place it on the desktop or wherever I want and I will say save. Once it's already saved, if I want to load it, it will appear here. You can check here the name of the file and the date of the latest save. So I will click again on the build option. And at this point, I will say goodbye. I encourage you to repeat this action sometimes till you get familiar with them. And I will see you in the next episode.